Hey guys, Natalia here with Mom's Dish. Today we're making this extra crispy chicken wings. They are so, so good, super simple to make. And we have a little secret best friend that will come join us and help us out with this. There is really no better way to make crispy chicken wings than in an air fryer. So that's my, gonna be my best friend today. I am so excited to introduce the air fryer to videos finally, because you know, if you follow us for a while, we love the air fryer. So here it comes. Let's go our ingredients. Ingredients are super simple. We have some chicken wings that I pet dried with a paper towel. Then we have salt and pepper. And then a few of my favorites to use from Trader Joe's is the seasoning salt and then 21 seasoning salute, plus a little pinch of uh, paprika is amazing. If you have any kind of spraying oil on hand, use this to spray the basket. That way the chicken doesn't stick to it. You can also use frozen chicken. And here's what you do. You set it in the air fryer for 10 minutes at 350. This will top the chicken and then after that season it and go with the next steps. I am gonna go ahead and season the chicken all in this bowl and toss it together. So let's start with some salt. Actually, today I won't be using a lot of salt because I wanna use one of the seasonings. Another seasoning I really, really like, I forgot to mention, is garlic parsley salt. I'm actually out of it. I get this huge jar of it at Costco and it just literally goes with all of my food. So if you can get your hands on garlic par parsley salt, put that in your chicken, so good. So some pepper. And then let's do this 21 seasoning. Salute, is that how you say it? I don't know. And some paprika. I like paprika. Oh, there's no lid on it. But I like paprika because it adds a nice color and also it adds that smokiness. So, need to be careful because it's missing the plastic part. I'm gonna go to town with this. Okay. I toss everything together with this. This is really convenient because this is what I'll use to move the chicken over to the air fryer as well. So, less dishes for me to clean. Let's toss it together. I might need a little more seasoning. Just enough to coat all the chicken. Okay, so we need to shake this thing up. I don't know if you need to, but shake it up. Spray the basket, and I love this avocado oil. It's actually really neat. Like, it's pretty powerful. And now, this is gonna taste like deep fried chicken, but you're actually not using a lot of oil just to spray the basket. It's amazing. So. I like to do one row, typically. Sometimes I'll load it up with all that chicken and just air fry it that way, but every five to seven minutes, I'll open it up, shake up the chicken to toss it together. That way all the sides do cook evenly, but let's do one row today just to make it easier for us. And this is a six quart um, air fryer, so it's not a big one. And we only have four people in our family, so this is a perfect one for our family. I load it up because chicken does shrink a little bit as it cooks. So I load it up quite a bit, as much as I can, and then I toss it. Okay, now we're gonna pop this basket into the air fryer. And I set it at 380 degrees for the first 15 minutes. Perfect, let's see the temperature. There you go. For the next 15 minutes, this will do the job for you. No oil, amazing. My best friend. <laughs> Once it's done cooking for the 15 first minutes, I like to take it out and churn everything in the basket a little bit, just toss it. That way all the sides cook evenly. And now for the last five minutes, we set it to 400 degrees for five minutes. So let's do this. 400 for five minutes. Beep, beep, beep. <laughs> there you go. We are done. Come on. Oh, do you hear that sizzle? Let's get them out of here. Guys, it's all done. There's no more steps. That's how easy it is. I'm just gonna place them on this little tray. And this is the perfect snack game day. Hopefully the games will happen this year. I don't know, when you're having friends over, movie night with the family, toss it with your big favorite barbecue sauce. Really serve it however you like. I just like them just like so because the crispy on the outside layer is so, so good. I will link to our favorite air fryer down below because I got this accidentally at Costco 
us just to test out the air fryer, whole thing about air fryers, and I was really smitten. So I really wanted to try making food in the air fryer because we love it so much. We have probably 12 or 13 recipes on our blog with the air fryer now. So definitely get one of these things and they're quite affordable. Ours was about $60, so yeah. The best part is here, we're gonna taste test, but let me know in the comments, do you have an air fryer? What is your favorite dish to make in an air fryer? I would love to hear from you because we're still testing a lot of recipes in here. My favorite for kids is bacon, and then this crispy chicken is also one of our top favorites. Let's try it, and don't forget to subscribe because we're coming back next week. Dipping it into ranch a little bit. That crunch. All right, it's a wrap for today. Thank you guys so much for staying with us. I hope you try this recipe because it's so, so amazing. And get an air fryer if you don't have one. I'll see you next time, bye.